hi everyone welcome to my channel today i'm gonna do 10 ways to pack the small side piece from the b set by jujube the b set comes in three pieces like three pouch and two straps so it comes in a small medium and a large pouch and also a long strap and a small strap out of all three pouches i think the small set piece is probably one of my favorite so i'm just going to show you like 10 different ways or maybe more than 10 i think i have 12 or maybe 13 a small set piece here and I will just show you the way that I use them so maybe we'll give you some ideas some of these ways are pretty common so it might be nothing new but I hope that maybe one or two ways can give you some ideas there's so many ways that you can use a B set um, I know I have a lot here I do have to de stash <laughs> But um, I really do love them all. Um, if I'm going to do stash, I think I might do stash the other set piece. Um, but the small set piece is something that I, I use all around the house. I use to put in my diaper bag, in my purse, etc. So I use it for so many different things. If there's any other ways that you think is pretty cool to pack, please let me know in the comments below. I'd love to know them. I'm going to start with this small set piece. This is in whimsical watercolor and it has the beautiful pink lining inside that I love. So this way is very common. It's packed as a purse. So I have a small coin purse and two B charts. So in here I have some coins and I have two B charge. In this one I have the cards that I use the most and this one is more cards that I wouldn't really use too much and everything fits perfectly in here. It fits pretty well in here. So these are in no particular order. This is the small set piece in Shakura Desk. And I've been sick lately, so I've been using this for teas. So in here I have things for hot chocolate for my kids and sugar and also honey and some uh, different teas. I'm usually a coffee drinker, but lately I've really been going for teas instead. This tea, I know it's nothing pretty, but this is Rebos, and it's one of my favorite ones. It is so good for you. So, this way is a pretty common. And it is just for an external charger for my phone. And also I have some earbuds in here, some cables, and a wall charge. That's all I have in here, but it's so perfect for that and time i always have this in my diaper bag this way here is kind of random but i truly use it for this reason and it's just to put some extra cash just a little bit of cash in here it's always good to have on hand because you know you never know when you need cash instead of a debit so it's just like kind of saving for a rainy day kind of thing truly i don't know why i have lipstick in there it's very random but i thought i would just show you exactly how it's packed in my house this one is Space Place. Um, you've probably seen me packed it this way in the past. It's packed with the Moonlight Projector and some extra disc. You just project the story using the light from your phone and there's so many beautiful stories and the kids love it. There's an app on your phone and you can read the story to them and it has different sound. It's really awesome and there's different stories for them. They really love this. But this one is in C-Punk. I use it just to carry my Kanga Care wet bag. So it packs pretty small, but I feel like the Kanga Care wet bag is pretty bulky and it takes a lot of space in my bag. So this way I feel it's super cool. So it has the wet bag in here and there's no, it's not packed in any particular way. I just kind of roll it and put it in there. It's pretty large and it takes a lot of space in a diaper bag, I feel. So, but it's pretty thin. Sorry you can hear the wind all the time, it's so windy, there's like one snowstorm after a snowstorm here in Canada and it's just super windy today. Wow, it's so loud, I'm sorry. And this is pretty big and pretty bulky in the back, so what I do is I just roll it up. There's no, I don't have any cute way to do this, no particular way to fold this. I just kind of fold it like this. Right now it's kind of hard to do because I'm behind the camera. But I just push it in here and it's very, it's really not that hard, honestly. It kind of goes in here very well. That's it. And this is super small and very compact and it's just perfect to put in a diaper bag. And in here you have a super large wet bag. So it's great for if you're going swimming or just, you know, just for any day really. Um, it's just, it doesn't take all that space in your bag. But this way is just with snacks. Here I just have uh, quite a few snacks, some uh, raisins, Smarties, 
some granola bars, little fishies. I also have some wet ones. Every time we go out somewhere, um, if they're going to be eating, I love to have a clean space for them. So in here, it's just for toys for my kids. Usually I would pack two of them, so one for each of the boys. And sometimes I can even attach some like little clip-on toys here too. They really love that. So in here I have some toys. I have some trains, stickers, some crayons, little notepads, a little bit of everything. It's just sometimes I will pack this differently so that um, when we go somewhere, I just give them this if I need them to be quiet or occupied. So I just give this to them and it's usually packed in different ways and they just have fun with it. They love it. Of course, I always pack a Tokidoki one because, you know, they love Tokidoki as much as, as me. <laughs> well, almost, almost. So for toys, I also have this way that I use a lot and it's with Story Cutes. I have seen a video from Gator Mom and also Busy with Five. I'm not sure um, who I got inspired to get this from, but it was one of them. And um, I will link the Story Cubes in the comments below, but this is like a really creative game for the kids. They make little uh, stories based on these different pictures. And honestly, my little one was so sick last year and we were at the hospital a lot. And this thing really saved me. So instead of having him go all over the place, the hospital and, you know, touch everything, we were able to play this game for hours and hours. And it was great. I mean, I love it and he loves it. And it's great for the restaurant as well or anything. So I strongly recommend to get these. This way is probably one of the ways that I use it the most. It's one of my favorite ways. So this is a small eight kit. So I have a little bit of everything in here. I'm gonna spread it out and you can see everything. But I also have a sunscreen that I don't always have at this time of the year, but I put it in there because usually I do have it in there, especially like in the summertime. This way is just to put like a small camera. This one I just have a GoPro. I have cables in here as well for it. So this camera would also fit in here perfectly, but this one I would usually put into the tech pocket of the diaper bag, but for the GoPro, I like to have it in here. So as you can see, it fits perfectly, just like a little small handheld camera. I'm so sorry about the noise, guys. I hope it doesn't bother you. The last one is Hello Kitty Dots and Stripes. It has a couple of things for me in here. Hand cream, uh, lip balm, powder, a uh, little mirror here, and some cute lip balms in here as well. And that's it. This is nothing exciting, but um, just to show you, I also use it to carry some batteries for my camera and a batteries for my flash. I'm not sure if you are a photographer and you're somewhat like me, you have nightmares of doing a photo shoot and your batteries are not charged. I'm not sure, am I the only one? But I don't know. I mean, I just had a nightmare last night where um, I, I was doing a wedding and my batteries weren't charged. So um, that scares me and I love to have them organized and know where they are at all times. This is very handy just to put some extra batteries. I like to know where my batteries are. I have several more. I always like to have two in here and this is always in my camera bag. Um, that's it guys. These are all the ways. This is this one is nothing exciting but um, I truly use it for that so I thought I would share with you. chance please let me know in the comments below which way is your favorite or like your top favorite ways to pack the small set piece I would love to know if you did enjoy this video please give it a like so I know to make more of these and again thank you so much for watching see you next time